This is Dr. Morse, and I would love to call this lesson 23. It's more like lesson 22 and 23 part two, okay? Uh, we talked about in the last tutorial how to construct a major scale using a given note in two different ways, okay? Next, we are going to learn uh, kind of how to figure out the key signatures and which scales need flats and which scales need sharps, okay? I'm telling you right now, you're gonna learn these. It's gonna be slow. You'll be like, hey, I did it. And then you're gonna figure out, if I memorize these, I'm so much faster, especially with Dr. Morris, who never gives me any time to take an actual test. It's always fly, 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 okay? So if you memorize these, you're gonna be so much better as if you're hunting for notes here. Oh, I need a flat here or I need a sharp here, okay? So how do we figure out if it's flat scale or a sharp scale? First of all, <laughs> if it starts with a flat, it's gonna be a flat scale. If it starts with a, uh, if it starts with nothing, okay, like C, D, E, F, G, it's going to be either C major, which has nothing, or a sharp scale. Oh boy, okay. So uh, you see how we constructed them last time. So if you start with a B flat, you're gonna get Remember, you write them all up, okay? So you write a C something, D something, E something, F something, G something, A something, and then back to B flat, okay? So at that point, you're gonna be like, okay, I'm gonna use my order of flats, and I've already used B flat, so it's, uh, it's already there. So I can skip to the next one, which is E flat, boom, right there, okay? And that's your B flat major scale. Okay, so just remember, if the first note is a just a note a, a letter by itself it is either c major which has nothing in the key signature or it is a sharp key signature if it starts with a flat it is a flat now there's one exception to that rule oh there's always an exception to the rule and that would be f okay f is a flat scale that does not follow that rule okay so you got to memorize F, you got to memorize C. I hope I have not been too confusing, but this is a whole bunch of skills here. This is taking uh, whole steps and half steps and constructing them into scales, okay? And you should be able to write 12. This has been Dr. Morris signing off on lesson 23 out of the Berkeley Music Theory Book One. Thank you.